Hello guys, today I'm going to be playing the demo for a game called Heavy Rain. Um, basically the game involves a killer who leaves behind little origami as sort of clues I guess. That's pretty much what I got from the description of the game on Epic Game Store, so yeah. Hold on guys, I'm um, just really quickly going to fix the settings because it looks like the graphics are making my computer run really badly. And I'm also going to turn down the volume just a slight bit more. I did mess with the settings a little bit before. Okay, I'm gonna leave the music at 59 and the FX at 67, should be good. I did turn the subtitles on, so it should be good for that. <laughs> Alright. But just to let you guys know, I most likely won't be playing the full game of this. I just wanted to test out the demo. That's cool. I like the way this game works. The controls are a little rocky. Um, I think it's because I don't have a keyboard them, like a separate keyboard, I'm playing on the laptop. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> hold on. Press and hold, okay. Sorry to go. I thought I could separately press them, I should have read that. It's okay. Good thing this is just a demo. I don't think I'd win. <coughs> oh, that was magic. Well, sorry. Goddamn asthma. You can't breathe when it rains. Oh, he has an inhaler. So if I hesitate to do actions, I'm not used to controls like this. F1. But the F1 online is the mute button. I, I don't think I can do that. Oh well. So what happens when you play on a laptop and not an actual desktop? Okay. He just clipped through the door. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope. Can't say it does. How do you even know that?
that dude was there. It's like, who is he talking to? Is he talking to the wall? Cool. Can I call anybody? I can't. Dang. The way this game controls is really weird. I think it's probably because I'm nice to perspective changing games that involve using WASD. Sorry about that cut screen right there. Um, Nothing I can do. The quality of this game is already on low. I wanted to put it on medium. But my computer, well, laptop can't handle it. So, we're on low settings. <laughs> oh, yeah. Keeps on freezing just a slight bit. I really am sorry about that. Lauren Winter? Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Wait. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. Wait a minute, are we here to investigate? Put your money on the table. You got exactly 10 minutes when the alarm rings, it's over, okay? Um, I, no, that's not what I came here for. I don't think I did. Did I? You should take your clothes off. We ain't got all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. Oh, shit, a cop. I should have known. What do you want, a freebie? Is that it? My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. The families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. I already told the police all I know and have nothing to add. Leave me alone. Hmm. I don't think she's gonna give me more Are you deaf? I have nothing to say to you. Get out of here. Oh, that was timed. I'll be compassionate. I understand, Lauren. Something. I know what you're going through. Oh, yeah? You know what it feels like to find your own son's body on a wasteland? I'm sorry, I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Okay, well, should have been convincing. The killer is walking around free as we speak. He'll kill again if he's not arrested. My Johnny's dead, so what difference does it make? No, one. Hmm. I bought 10 minutes of your time, didn't I? All I ask is that you use that time to answer some questions. You want to pay me to tell you about my son? Is that it? You can buy my body, Mr. Shelby, but my son is not for sale. Get out of here. Get the fuck out! Should I have tricked her? That seems more wrong. I thought buying and buying more time. My bad. Well, if you remember anything, the smallest detail, give me a call. Tried to be nice. What did I do that was so wrong? Where's the door? I'm not sure. You're gonna let me leave? Wait, what did it say? It doesn't even give me enough time. Where am I? Investigation. Yeah. Investigation. I didn't learn squat. Well, it's worth a try. Yeah? What now? Lord. No point in pushing it. She's not going to tell me anymore. That's what I was trying to tell you to begin with. I got to get out of here. Yeah. You think? I can't tell where I am. Oh, that's not the door. That's not the door. 
Uh-oh. Did we not enter, like, right here? I'm so- Oh, there's the door. Well, we lost our main lead, it looks like. Stop puffing and puffing for like one second, dude. You're indoors, your ass is gonna be fine. <coughs> Maybe he's not so fine. Walk past me. Didn't care at all that this dude having an asthma attack. Lauren, open up, baby. It's me. Joy, what are you doing here? I already told you I don't want to see you anymore. Sorry, doll, but I really wanted to see you. Oh, come on now. We just got over an asthma attack, and now we have to stop this guy from getting to the girl. Ah! Yep. Why do you knock, dude? Ah! Push the door open. Push the door open. Oh my. What do you want, asshole? Lauren, is everything all right? She's just swell. Now beat it, loser! Imagine this dude, the Oregon killer. You again? If... Oh! Oh, I missed that uh. kill. They come up really quickly. Uh. Oh, wow. Yeah. Probably To mind your own business, asshole. Oh. Oh. I've seen you, bitch. Oh. Are you all right? To tell you the truth, <laughs> I remember having felt better. Oh. Who was that guy? An ex-client who thinks he owns me. He was getting violent. I told him I didn't want to see him anymore. Oh. In any case. He packs a good right hook. <laughs> oh. Mr. Shelby. Yeah. Thanks. Oh. See, the thing is, I did what it said. I held down the indicator buttons, but sometimes it didn't work. And other times I just completely misclicked. The mouse themes, though, they don't seem to track exactly right. Like, I would do the downward motion. I think the same thing is just slightly 
Either that or it just been really bad. It's pausing again. Every time there is a large cutscene or like any cutscene at all, it just completely freaks out. Yeah. Yikes. This zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Check. You can pass. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. I'm not used to quick action buttons in a game. I think that's part of my issue. Video memo recording. Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8.14 a.m. That's interesting. I'm looking for Lieutenant Carter Blake. Thanks. Lieutenant Blake? I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning. They told me to be here. Now, if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. 
And we're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No. No, of course not. That's... that's not what I meant. Do we know the cause of death? There are no marks on the body. Chances are he was drowned. Like the others. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit-stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Do you have any leads? My men are going over to scene with a fine-tooth comb. If the killer left anything behind, we'll find it. Listen, mm -hmm. I, I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later, back at the office? Oh, well, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. Hey, Jade. You come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. When did they find the body? Excuse me, but... Who are you exactly? Nam and Jaden, FBI. If you want to ask questions, you should speak to Lieutenant Blake, sir. Oh, these cops are horrible. I'm trying to help you guys. Aren't we supposed to work together? Well, they're not going to tell me anything. So I guess I will have to work myself. I don't think you can let us tell me anything. We were watching her earlier really after we were going to, uh, we kind of like, I did see a little mask off and I think it was by the scene over here. Might be going now. Yeah, no, it's still there. Yeah, 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 it's still there. Harry, comment. The victim is lying on his back. No visible signs of violence. Superficial wound on the right thigh. Blood analysis suggests it could be post-mortem. Probably a scratch that occurred when the body was being moved. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion. His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. Interesting. I think that's all we might get here. There is a little something over here. Harry comment, sample of no interest, comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. Oh, gee, thanks for leaving your DNA everywhere. Making my job a lot harder. Some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. Okay, so then what does that tell us exactly? Hmm. Try follow it. I'm gonna re it because I wanna record the new thing. Oh. A small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. So I don't know where I'm sorry for me. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. Okay. The victim is Jeremy Bowles, declared missing five days ago. See reference file. That's my best guess. He's gonna... 
Yeah. I'm gonna leave. I see you in the office, right? Okay. See you later. Really? I'm not gonna tell him? No, no. That's your office I do, apparently. We got our origami killer. I want every available man to finding Ethan Mars. Ethan Mars is innocent. I can prove it. The room looks like I finished it in under 45 minutes. I guess that's just for people who probably look at everything. Well guys, that was the demo of Heavy Rain. For those of you who want the full game, you can fight off of the Epic Games Store, and so I will be back for another video soon. I'm not sure what I'm going to play, but I will definitely find something for you guys.